Sometimes people reach to the past to see if they still have access to you because they have no attachment to anything in the present. So they resort to the last thing they took for granted. And they won't say it, but you're the only person to make them truly happy. You made up for the things they lacked, so they latched onto you for their satisfaction and, and the initial attraction. It was pure passion, but those moments of infatuation never truly last. We get excited and we move too fast and then you're alone again before you realize what happened. It's easy to get trapped and you begin to question your own actions. Like maybe I shouldn't have reacted that way. How abruptly things collapse. Personally, I start to detach because it's something I'm good at. There's so much space on this mattress now. My soul blackened, my hope shattered, my clothes tattered, and this home dilapidated. My world flattened and nothing matters and I'm haunted by my own shadows. But they always come back, don't they? Relationships should flow naturally and the patterns should make sense. Every time we match with someone we think is the one we've been asking for. I'm not a pessimist, but I've accepted reality and some things lose their importance. Like once you've been had, it takes a lot to reopen that door. The storms pass, but they always come back at some point. And I know it's hard to shake old habits, but it's time to reevaluate the gravity of our decisions. Is it worth it to repeat patterns? How long will you remain captive, shackled by spur of the moment choices and thinking irrationally? How much value do you see in yourself? Clear your mind of the static and imagine all the people you're potentially compatible with and all you need is one. But not this one, because they've already had their chance. <laughs>